Welcome to another episode of Hereford FC here in Vanilla FM and we're going to take a look at the new season 2026-2027 starting with the new squad. So there have been quite a lot of changes from last year to this year. A lot of players have left and um, we're trying to kind of build momentum back up to the playoffs. So it was kind of tricky to improve the squad at all. I don't think the squad is better but somehow um, I th still think we're going to achieve better than last season. Uh, if we look at the season preview, last oh actually it's dropped down again, but they've given us better ratings than last year. So last we've always been like down bottom, so we kind of slightly better this year in that respect. Uh, and the um, I think the players themselves. Um, think that we can do better. I've kind of taken a slightly different strategy for this year and then I'll um, I'll explain in a little bit. So starting with uh, goal, we have one new goalkeeper, Owen Evans. So he's going to be probably our main goalkeeper. We still have Thomas Miles from last year. Um, he's kind of in the background. He actually wants to leave but uh, we kept him on for a little bit longer. No changes in the right side of the fence. We still have uh, Ethan Evan, uh, sorry, Ethan Vaughan and also Sambird. We still have them too. In the left side, we actually have three new players. So we have, starting with Luke Garbutt. He's um, brand new to us, but he's not brand new in the game. He's 33 years old, so he's the experience. We also have a kid on loan from Scotland. We tried to get him last year, but we couldn't. Uh, Junior McKilnan. He's with us from Livingstone on loan. But we also got this guy just on a short loan. So uh, this is kind of the road that I went down, like to slightly improve the squad a little bit, I went and I got short loans to kind of settle in the team and then these guys will disappear off at the end of October, um, which is why I've got Junior playing for the other 21s at the moment. So Mikey Dimitrion is um, an experienced player and is with us from Newport, a rival team. In the defensive midfield we still have Tom Lapsley, but we also got uh, Kean Tansley as a new player for that position. He's not particularly brilliant. Uh, in the midfield we have two new players, Aaron Arnott from Wraith from Scotland and also Tommy Piper on loan. He's a new gen which you can name. You can change his name if you want to. You can go to Patreon and sign up and you can have a senior new gen play uh, named after you. I'll let you go and check that out. Um, then in the right side of attack, uh, also no changes. We have still had Adam O'Shea. Not a very good player, but there we go. And we still have Raylon. Rayon, sorry, Rayon Dillon. Also in the right side of attack. On the left side, only one change. Uh, we still have Eric Souza, who did quite well for us last year. But we have also um, Fedel Roslang from Jamaica, 22 year old from Salford. And finally, in attack, we have. Oh, actually, I, f I skipped over the, c the central defenders. I'll show them in the met. But in attack we still have Leighton Stewart who wants to leave at the end of the season. We still have Ian, um, Owen Pollock and we have two new attackers on loan. We have Mohamed Jatta from Gambia from Crew, and we also have Ben Jebols Bonski, Scottish player from Morton. Um, now in the center of defense we also got five players instead of four because one of them is on a short loan. Harrison Burke is with us again um, but only on a short loan so he'll go away again in um, the end of October. Uh, the only repeat from last year is uh, Jacob uh, uh, Gulley 
Reggie Evans has returned after having gone away for a season. He's uh, with us on loan. And finally, we have Kane Jobson on loan. And we also have Rico Brown. He's with us on a permanent deal, but at the moment, he's probably our best central defender, to be fair. Uh, but at the moment, I'm playing Harrison Burke. So, I played a few matches. I won one and lost two. Playing Barnett next. We're probably going to lose this one. I don't know what the prediction is, actually, from the club. Uh, da, da, da. Oh, we're going to have to go quite far down. No, oh, they haven't given us one for some reason. Probably can go to Vision match performance yeah a draw they think we could draw so let's see if we can do that so here we are in our stadium which is now being shared with Forest Green as they renovate their own stadium so that's giving us a little bit extra income I'll need to go away and figure out how many new gens we have now in a squad so I can update the Patreon. There's one point difference between us and Barnet at the moment. And here we are, kickoff. Now this team doesn't feel as good as last year, um, but I'm hoping that with time, they will gel together. Cohesion is average. We still have some um, highly influential players in place from last season, so hopefully we can have some team leaders soon. Let's see if we can get on the counter-attack here. Ooh. Oh, he's not going to reach. Lapsley. Come on, boys. Ah, oh, man. to stay safe through all of that. attack isn't getting off too well I don't think our youth team is doing well they've been promoted to the third division uh, and um, and I think last time I checked they were first place although they only had played two get two matches um, but yeah I think they're doing well even for this level they will be doing quite well they're actually playing against Forest Green under 18s as well, so uh, they'll be using the same stadium, I think, for home and away games against that team. And here we go, the first goal for Barnet. They've been trying and trying for the last 20 minutes, so not much from our end as far as highlights. <laughs> I 
now that, that those two short loans uh, will take us through to the f I think the first round of the FA Cup I can't remember now anyway end of October that's kind of 25th of October I think is when they expire and go back Mm, okay. One sub a half time. I, I, I wanted to get Stuart out, but I don't have anyone to put in his place. Think about that one for a minute. Sandbird's coming in, and now this one, the best match. I'm gonna come I'm going to put Harrison in. Nice pass into Stewart. Can he cross? He got through. Penalty. Lapsley to take it, the captain. Although Lapsley is carrying an injury, so that could be tricky. Yeah. Lucky that one. And another goal. Oh, that's not a that's not a draw. There's nothing to do with the draw. Maybe I should have gone balanced for this match. So we need to make up a lot of ground to make sure we're close to those playoff zones. Although it's still early in the season, so we can do it. We can definitely do it. I'm going to carry on and progress until the mid-season, probably come back around February or so, and as per usual, we'll catch up then. Thanks so much for watching until the end, and if you like and subscribe, thanks so much as well, and take care. See you next one. Bye-bye.